the aircraft is quite simply the, the most capable combat aircraft in the world today. Um, uh, and it has a tremendous amount of redundancy built into that. So the, uh, the potential for the future development of this aircraft, really the sky's the limit for, for what it can do. Right now, its, uh, its performance is, is outstanding. It's been repeatedly demonstrated in uh, large-scale exercises uh, over in the US with kill ratios in the re region of 144 to zero. Um, and, and to operate it on those, these large-scale exercises really demonstrates its potential and capability. Uh, and it has been pretty well proven. So. Uh, I have no doubts about this aircraft. I think it has a lot of potential for the future, but right now it is, it is uh, I mean, ahead of everything else. So. It's, as you can imagine, it's, it's sensational. Obviously, uh, it's been 20 years in the making, uh, and they've really done a, a first-rate job. The, the aircraft is, is sensational. You know, combination of super cruise, stealth, uh, unrivaled maneuverability, you know, fantastic avionics. All of this contributes to really make the, uh, the F-22 unique, and the only fifth generation fighter in the world today. Really. I'm immensely privileged. I'm obviously the, the, the luckiest pilot in the Royal Air Force. Um, and I mean, really, it was just a case of, of being in the, in the right place at the right time. And, and uh, the stars aligned, and I just happened to get picked for the exchange. So a very humbling experience, and obviously an immense privilege to be able to fly the most capable airplane in the world. You know, obviously, it was a, a great opportunity to go and fly the F-22. But yeah. one of the nicest parts of the, the whole program, the exchange program, has been how accepting they have been of me, and it's just such a warm welcome. I mean, welcoming me to this, you know, their, their, their newest toy. Uh, I've made, I had the opportunity to work with some tremendously talented people, and made some really good friends, and really they've made me feel at home. I, I genuinely feel at home and uh, a part of the United States Air Force. It's been first, first rate.